Welcome to Tricky's Kitchen where delicious food is made easy. Today Tricky is preparing Persian saffron brittle. That looks yummy. It's an Iranian brittle candy made with tahini, saffron strands, almond, sugar and syrup. It requires an art of precision to do every step correctly, quickly and in a timely manner to get that perfect outcome. So let's get straight to the ingredients. Note, all the ingredients measured using measuring cups and spoons are leveled and not heaped. Method Place parchment paper or greaseproof paper over a chopping board. Alternatively, as you can see in the screen above, you can grease and line a tray. Then pound two pinches of saffron strands along with one pinch of sugar. Soak the pounded saffron strands in hot water and set aside. Melt sugar on low heat in a non-stick vessel. Remember to use the smallest burner or the smallest flame. We have to do every step correctly, quickly and in a timely manner from now on. So add in the tahini and the syrup and stir continuously. Now turn up the heat Add in the saffron water and mix well to combine. Remember to work quickly. Add in the salt and the cardamom powder and continue to mix. Again reminding you to work quickly. Drop in the chopped almonds and mix well to combine. Remember we've turned the flame off so we got to work quickly. Add in the soda bicarbonate and mix well. Carefully but quickly pour the mixture onto the parchment paper and level the top using the back of a spoon. Now sprinkle some chopped pistachios and chopped almonds over the top and cover it with parchment paper or greaseproof paper. Use a rolling pin to flatten out the mixture. Use pressure if needed and press down and roll out as thinly as possible. Cut into desired shapes and sizes and keep aside for one to two hours and allow it to set. Alternatively, you can omit this step and you can leave it as it is and break it into pieces later on. Chop 
check that it has fully set, then break into pieces and store in an airtight container. That's a snap and another snap there. So there you have it, some delicious Persian saffron brittle. Thank you for stopping by, do hope you will give this recipe a try. Have lots of fun in the processes you toy and most of all don't forget to enjoy. If you liked this simple and easy recipe, be sure to like, share, comment and subscribe if you have not yet to Tricky's Kitchen where delicious food is made easy.